Moving on, Josh Allen to Emmanuel Sanders as the Bills take down Washington easily 43-21, and that combination led the way. Watch out. That's all I can say. Watch out. To me, it's – it's um, you know, I'm going to sit here and look just to, before I clarify this comment. Buffalo is the best team in the AFC. Buffalo is the best team in the AFC. They had no business losing week one to Pittsburgh. You still have KC as a second? I, um, that that no, noise I'm gonna answers Cleveland, my question. I'm going to make Cleveland two probably okay. and then KC three right now. That's okay. probably what I would do. Yeah, That's a good question on. though. No, you're, you're, I'm glad you said that because I was like, oh, wait, where am I going to put them? Yeah. Um, but, yeah, I, I just look at Buffalo and go – Scary because the defense is real. Special teams are real. The offense sputtered the first two weeks and watch out. Now they got a little momentum in week two against Miami. It wasn't pretty, even though they won 35, nothing. And now this, this week here, you know, just to me, it's showing that like, they're not going to have to just depend on Josh Allen to win every game. They can do it any way, but if man, if the offense is playing like it did yesterday, yeah, they're going to be unstoppable. It's almost be 80 points the last two weeks. Yeah, almost 80 points. I mean, domination. Against Washington Miami and, and Miami. Washington, right? Good defenses. Yeah. You, you expect Washington's defense is a disappointment so far this year. Big ja- time. Yeah, Jack Del Rio is going to have to go back to the lab a little bit. You know, I don't think he can be so vanilla and just think, wait, we're going to be sound and let our front four get after people and we just won't blow any coverages in the background. I think he's going to have to start, you know, dialing up maybe some more creative pressures, coverages that way. But, like, you know, Allen yesterday, <laughs> uh, it just some of the plays and throws are. Some, it, it looks like, and you, you have kids about the same age as mine, and they're probably still using the smaller footballs. Yeah, right. He's playing in the NFL like I feel when I'm in the yard with one of those junior high balls. He he, he throws the NFL ball like I, that sometimes. Uh, uh, Just kind of toys with it. He toys with it. You know, R- Rodney last night on, on our Peacock show, he said Josh Allen's the best quarterback in the AFC. Mm. And I went, like, first off, I was like, that's my boy, Blue. I'm just happy to hear him say right. that. But – you know, the more I thought about it, I just went, eh, I mean, right now, I, I, he might be. I mean, it's him and Mahomes are definitely special. And Herbert's got to be there, too, Herbert's right now. right there, too. Thank yeah. you very much. You're exactly right. He is right there with him, too. Um, but I think, again, what separates Josh Allen is just a few of the plays you saw yesterday. Like, nobody's there. And, okay, move up in the pocket, bounce out to the outside, and then, shoo, like, whoa, there's vapor trails. Like, he. 30-yard completion, touchdown, back shoulder throw. It's Vapor just, trail is like, such a good way to describe it's, it's it. It's yeah, just unreal. It like. That's where it's unreal. And then they got a little bit of a run game, just, just enough, enough. Yep. and they're protecting pretty well all three weeks. I know even in the Pittsburgh game, I know he got strip sack, fumbled, and hit a few times. If you go back and watch, he had all day some of those plays. He just got greedy and waited all day to, for somebody to get open. But, yeah, I would say watch out for Buffalo because I think now they got the offense rolling, they're, they're going to be a, an SOB. I want to throw in one of the questions here uh, at Dalton Menjin. Damn okay. We've had a couple of damn okays here at the Victory yeah. Lab. Woo. Just sprinkle them in here throughout. Josh Allen realized we weren't in preseason anymore. <laughs> Understandable confusion seeing as he didn't play in the first two preseason games. It's great to have him back. Yeah, no, it, it is great. And, and you know, hey, like we've talked about, it's hard to play a team like Pittsburgh to start the year because yeah. they just are so crazy on defense. So you're like, damn, it's our first game. Especially when Watt's bullets, playing. And Watt He's was not, playing. No, yeah. Right. So that – Miami, yeah, it wasn't pretty last week. You know, but Miami, they got off. Their defense played good. They jumped off to a start, and then they didn't really have to, like, keep their foot on the gas pedal offensively, too. But I think they made enough plays and did some things so they went, okay, we're on the right track. And then we saw it yesterday. So, yeah, that's right. Damn okay. Buffalo's here. My boy Blue. Giddy up, giddy up, Josh Allen. Hi, I'm Mike Tirico, and thanks for watching. Make sure to hit subscribe for the latest news and highlights from NBC Sports.